Hi, today we are going to discuss about fistula occlusion test for checking maximum blood flow for AVF and AVG. And also, we are going to check how much minimum blood flow we are supposed to keep for checking fistula occlusion test. We are supposed to monitor arterial pressure and venous pressure. So, we connect both. Step. Keep blood flow 140 ml per minute and hold one finger in between arterial and venous needle. And close monitor our arterial pressure and venous pressure and make a flow diagram. So we can go through this display. We keep 140 ml per minute blood flow and arterial pressure is around 15. And we can gradually increase 40 ml per minute is a 180 in this 20 arterial pressure and again we can increase blood flow into 220 in this we can show is like minus 122 arterial pressure and again we can increase 240 and this is around minus 50 and again increasing and we will get 300 blood flow minus 82 arterial pressure and in 340 it's minus 122 and again skip increase 40 as 380 blood flow is a gradual decline in arterial pressure is going up to 200 minus 200 so reduce 40 ml per minute and make it 340 is maximum blood flow and this diagram is showing is a rapid decline from 340 to 380 so maximum blood flow we can keep 340 ml per minute. Next we can discuss about minimum blood flow how we can calculate. It is simple formula by using our target weight. Weight is around 55.2 right now. So how we can calculate is 55.2 multiply with 2.5 we will get 138 and add 100 I will get 238. So 230 ml per minute is minimum blood flow we supposed to keep. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. More points we'll discuss on next episode.